Buck Day celebrations continue in Corpus Christi Bayfront today with the opening of the night, uh, the opening night rather of the carnival. In fact, the doors are just opening right now for the week long event. Michelle Pedraza joins us now live and see what we can expect. Hi, Michelle. Hey, Rudy, that's right. It's just about to kick off already. So many people in line for the carnival and they check it out. They have food rides. They're going to have a petting zoo and pig races and you can't forget the pirates. And right now I have the red dragon pirates with me. I have Lady Crimson and Blue Phoenix and you guys are going to have some shows going on, right? Ah, uh, yes, we're going to have shows of magic and lots of fire. Let's take a look at the fire. Let's get a zoom in on that. Absolutely incredible. And so why do you guys keep coming out every year? What does it mean to you and to your community? Well, being the this festival has been going on for so long. It's just it's it's meaningful to the community and to us. And it also encourages people to come to Port A, support Port A, the rebuilding of Port A. And when they come on the Red Dragon, it's not just an experience, it's a memory. That's right. And, and for you, why do you think it's so important for the community to know the history of our city? Well, the, knowing the history helps us to re not repeat the bad ones, I. <laughs> Pirates are all about democracy and all of that things. And, uh, and you guys are going to be performing really every on. night here, right? All right, we're going to be performing at least twice every night. Excellent. Okay, so if you're wanting to come out here, it's going to be for about for the next 10 days. It's going to be $6 for adults and kids get in for $4. So make sure you come on out here. It's going to be on the Bayfront downtown all week long. Rudy? All right, thanks, Michelle. Looks, uh, looking forward to that. It's going to be a lot of fun.